Okay, number 14, I'll go to the whiteboard to do it. and Give me one second to get the document opened. And we're doing number 14. So I gotta go to the whiteboard and I'll do a long division. And I'll write it down. And what are we dividing? And I'll write this down. So it's gonna be x squared. Let me write this, let me write the original problem down. It's three, whoops, that's not what the original problem is. Three plus five x minus 2x cubed, and we're dividing by x squared uh, minus 3x uh, cubed plus x4. Just make it a tad bit simpler. I'm gonna factor out an x squared in the bottom, and then I'll do my long division. So it's gonna be three plus five x minus two x cubed Let's see, 1 minus 3x plus x squared. So I want to point out what we're doing. We're going to do long division on this, and then I'll multiply by this later. All right, let's put this down. So it's 1 minus 3x plus x squared divided into 3 plus 5x minus 2x cubed. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put the missing place down. You don't have to do that if you don't want to, though. Let's start. Looks like a three. Three minus nine x, and then plus three x squared. All right, so what are we gonna do there? We're gonna subtract, right? We get 14 x minus three x squared minus two x cubed. Let's start again. 14 x, you get 14 x. Let's see, minus, let's see what that give you. 30 and 12, 42. x squared plus 14 x cubed. Let's keep going. What do you get now? You subtract, you're gonna get uh, 39 x squared Right? Minus 16 x cubed. Let's keep going. And now what I'm gonna do is, we gotta get that to five terms, right? <clears throat> Let's see, 39. That's 39 x squared. Let's see, 90 and 27, 117 x <coughs> x cubed plus 39 x4 got to subtract that's going to be let's see 101 x cubed minus 39 x4 got to do another matching game don't we we're at the fourth term now so 101 x cubed that's 101 x cubed. And then you get minus 303 x uh, 4. Or maybe you get plus 101 x 5. I think we're almost there. What I got to do, I got to subtract now. And let's take a look at that. So it's going to be uh, minus 39 plus 303. Uh, and that's going to be 2. 64. I, I got to check that out myself. 264. 300. I got to check. Hope I didn't make a mistake. I got to write this down now. 303 minus 39. Yeah, 264. Let me just add. I, I, I hate to, I, to do this to you, but I have to check it. 3, 10, yeah, 303, right? Okay, let me get my eraser. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Oh, there it is. So that it disappears on me, you know? I almost forgot what I was going to do here. 
So what's he gonna do more? Not really, I'm gonna get five places. I got four, so what's gonna be? Plus 264. X4, yada, 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 yada. I'm not gonna do the yada, yada, yada. So somebody says, are you done? No, we're not done. What we have to do is we have to multiply that by this. So it's gonna be one over X squared times that thing we just found, which is three plus 14X. We'll check the key later, by the way. Plus 39X squared plus 101 X cubed plus 264 X4 plus yada, yada, yada. Well, I'm gonna multiply it. Let me get my eraser because I need some things that are here that I don't need anymore. I need that space. And then we'll check the K. All right? So what do you get over here? Let's see, three over X squared plus 14 over X plus 39 plus 101x, plus 264, x, uh, x squared, right? Yeah, plus yada, yada, yada. Let's get our red pen out. I'm gonna look at the key. Gotta wake my computer up again, and I'll take a look. They wrote it with negative exponents, but that's fine. I see that, I see that. I see a 39, 101x, 264x squared. We're doing good, thank you.